game button pressed. <laughs> That's more like it. Max Payne and Sean and James Bond. All right. I saw what you were trying to do there, buddy. Yeah, the controls threw me off. I think we're all just... dead. <laughs> The final gunshot was an exclamation mark for everything that had led up to this point. And the piano chords do. Do do. Oh, you got to do the piano chords. Do 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 do. To make any sense, I had to go back three years. Back when the pain started. <laughs> do do do. <laughs> Do, 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 Is this the pain residence? Do, 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 do. Yeah, there's been an inverter intruder or whatever. Call 911. I'm afraid I can't help you. Hello. <laughs> Michelle! No! 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 Man, my uh, field of view was all fucked up. Yeah, it's, it's defaults to something low, I'd, I'd change it. Oh, well, I'm gonna fix that if I can. Real yeah, it's just quick. the options menu, it's a bar. Don't tell you shit, it's just a bar. Oh, there you go, yeah. I guess 90. That's a lot better, there we go. <laughs> now I can see what the fuck I'm doing. Tell me about it. Aha, yes, this is definitely the level we got up to, because this is the point last time where you wussed out and had to leave. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, boy. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Shut up, I was on a holiday, okay? Oh, Shut the didn't. fuck up. What the hell is that? that was me laughing. <laughs> so, what have you been up to? So, does the sound of joy make you uncomfortable? Holy it does. shit! <laughs> oh, 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 clear. Uh, why you do this? What are you doing? Killing shit. Oh. Flaky. Or getting killed by shit. There I was beating Dark Souls and thinking I was a badass, and then this is just making me feel guilty again. Man, Dark Souls is easy. <laughs> you, haven't even, have you, played, you haven't played it, have you? No, I haven't. <laughs> well then, well, they're saying that I'm pretty shit at the next one, at number two. I'm like level 50 and I haven't actually left the starting area because <laughs> I've just been grinding <laughs> to try and get my way through it. In my defense, I haven't played any of them to be honest. Yeah, attacks kind of home in on you a little bit. I've noticed like you roll out of the way, but the attack still hits you, which is all kinds of bullshit. So I don't feel good. Hmm. But uh, yeah, I thoroughly enjoyed the first one, and uh, I'm gonna get three as soon as I'm done with two. Nice. I also um, have you checked out the Doom Open Beta? Uh, no. I'm not really interested in that. The the multiplayer, you mean, or the game itself? Yeah, yeah. I'm I'm all for the single player, man. I recommend just grabbing. You know me. Yeah. I hate playing games with other people. <laughs> yeah, I know. What are you doing right now? Huh? <laughs> I wish I'm, I didn't have to do I'm this. A, I'm not real. I'm a sophisticated <laughs> AI. You programmed who disagrees with you and everything. Oh, okay. Beep boop. I am yeah. Shodan, the male version, who's kind of a pushover. <laughs> the male version of Shodan. What was I saying? Xerxes. Anyway, yeah, it's worth playing just to see how well yes. you can run it. Because um, other than that, I played it and oh. I got to the top of the school board in the first match I played. I was like, yeah, that's good enough for me, and I installed it. I did actually find it quite fun, but I, you know, this is the thing: it's free. So I think if I'd paid forty quid for that, I probably wouldn't have been impressed with it. Well. Yeah. Because this is the problem I have with Here's uh, hoping it doesn't suck. 
Yeah, I, I don't think they're single player. I mean, this is the problem I had. I bought Black Ops 3 because the, the multiplayer beta, I actually got a free invite into it because uh, I had Black Ops 2. And I really enjoyed it. I was like, ah, oh, that's quite fun. But then I bought the game and I never touched the multiplayer. I played it once and never played it again. So <laughs> I was like, hmm. That had a really hmm. weird single player campaign. Uh, sorry, which game again? Black Ops 3. Call of Duty, basically. Oh, yeah, no, that is the only one of the Black Ops that I haven't played. It's got like a... I played 1 and 2, but uh, Let's never talk... touched 3. Let's talk about the. So, what okay. do you think of the first Black Ops? Uh, I actually, I'm not much of a Call of Duty fan. Uh, like, I liked the first one. And, uh,. United Offensive and then Call of Duty 2. That shit was great. Call of Duty 4 I kind of liked as well because it was something new. Like not. Um, World War 2. Not World War 2 anymore, yeah. And then we got Modern Warfare 2 and World at War, I think. But yeah, and then I really Black didn't Ops. care for the world, uh, the Modern Warfare games because. Uh, it seemed quite soulless. Like that's around the time Call of Duty became an annual franchise, you know. Yeah. Um, but then Black Ops still had some of that soul, you know, that, that the earlier games had. Yeah, I can get that. It was like it took some risks and it tried new things that we hadn't seen before. Yeah, I quite like the, the so, mission where you're on the rooftops in like China raining and Eddie like Uzis and there's like, uh, like, yeah, yeah, that shit was cool with the dragon's breath round just going through the building. Uh, yeah, 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 it yeah, had yeah, yeah. Moments in it. Are they all? I mean, <coughs> they get a lot of stick, and I think part of that is because they're just so expensive even now. But I do enjoy them. I mean, I haven't played Ghosts because I've heard that's really bad. But you know. I like the first. I like the, the fi my favourite one is Black Ops 2 because the campaign actually kind of changed, and it did it in a really natural way most of the time. Like if you won a mission or lost it, you wouldn't get a game over. It would just change the storyline a bit, which I thought was really cool. Ghosts. Oh yeah, call. Oh uh, no, Black Ops 2. Yeah. Black Ops 2. Yeah. Um, I don't remember it too well. Yeah, it's been a while since I've last played. Did it change the storyline if you died? I don't remember any of that. It sort of did if you died in there's bonus missions, like not bonus, like side missions where oh. you play like soldiers, and if you fail them, the story does change a little bit. It's nothing dramatic, but oh yeah, those uh, strike ops, which real time kind of, uh, strategy bits or something which like were that. Pretty kind of crappy, really. Cause yeah, they it were, didn't yeah. work well. I mean, what normally happened to me was that I'd lose everyone but one, and then I'd just hole up in a corner and win it that way. Yeah. But, you know, you can't fault them, because they're experimenting with something, which is what everyone asks them, people to do with the Call of Duty series. Yeah, I liked it, yeah. Well, I, I like Black Ops 1 more than 2, because... Yeah. I don't know exactly why. <laughs> I don't know, I think it was just a better game. I guess. Yeah. No, I, I do prefer the second one because, uh, you know, it flipped between like the passing thing and you got the level where you're like a Musha Hadid on a, on yeah. a horse. Which yeah, is yeah, really cool. on the horse. Yeah, that was. Although that shit was awesome. It That's did true. get a bit retarded at the end because then it's like suddenly, oh, here's a Russian super tank and you're like, what? What? <laughs> then you get out and you have a <laughs> fist fight with him and then they betray you and then it's just like, what's going on, man? Why can't we go through that door? I think we have to kill the bull. Where is this bull? Uh, I think it's been transported outside the level. Oh no, there's a Fuck. Oh, you killed it. Yeah. Let's see if I can rocket jump up here. Oh, nice! Ah, oh. Oh, god damn it. Okay, I need to be. You do. More You're a lot better at rocket jumping in this game than me. I don't have much experience. <laughs> <laughs> I might have to take those words back. <laughs> yeah. You got it. You're gonna have to draw its attention somehow, because I can't. Where is it? 
It's like behind a wall, but I can't shoot it. Hold on, I need to die. In it. There we go. Hey! Oh, there we go. That did the trick. Yeah, that's quite buggy. I don't really know in Sam to have problems like that. Oh, shit. Oh! <laughs> God! Sam's in a lot of pain, or Max rather. And now suddenly we are oh, okay. somewhere else completely different. <laughs> Fuck, right, this is... Whatever. I am now confused. Gotta give the Sam games credit. They're not very buggy, but then I suppose there's not that much you can fuck up, really. Yeah. Alright, back on track. <laughs> nice. So, uh, what have you been up to the last couple of weeks? Uh, oh, tell us about your holiday. Or tell me about your holiday. My holiday. Uh, else is viewing this? <laughs> you told me about it on her uh, oh, on Steam. I was thinking you were being, uh, you were having another <laughs> schizophrenic episode there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Me and and. Uh, tell me another James. Samaj. <laughs> <laughs> Evil James. Uh, oh, what? what uh, yeah, no, uh, it was nice. You know, been to Stockholm and uh, Helsinki. And finally, uh, Tallinn. And uh, yeah, it was nice. Cool. But uh, I had been in Stockholm like two years ago. So, we already saw most of it. It was just ah. cheaper to fly straight to Stockholm. But uh, yeah, we did a pub crawl there. Some nice, good times. Oh, and uh, like our, yeah, we stayed at a hostel, and they were organizing uh, pub crawls. And our group leader uh, works, or rather, is from a town <laughs> like ten or twenty kilometers away from here. <laughs> so he was Belgian, and apparently <laughs> he's a friend of one of my coworkers. <laughs> So, you know, small world. Uh, yeah. Yeah. And then, after that, Helsinki, which wasn't really that impressive. I felt sorry to any uh, Finnish <laughs> viewers <laughs> that we might have. Which means Miko. <laughs> but yeah, Tallinn, Estonia, that's fucking great though. Yeah, that's really gorgeous. If you ever uh, get a chance, I would highly suggest you go there. Yeah. Because it's so pretty. Oh, it's teleporting me around. Or is it? Uh, is it yeah. Oh, it is, yeah. For a second I was like, yeah, yeah, oh, I see what's going on now. I was like, oh, am I pinging out again, really? Yeah, it sounds no, no, quite no, this is I would a, like to visit trap things, level. but I, I don't have a passport. I mean, getting one... I so? You really don't need a passport? You don't need a passport for, uh... Oh wait, the UK isn't part of Schengen, are they? I don't think so. I don't know. Probably <laughs> not. <laughs> Learn something about your world, man. Oh, I would do, but it's all so depressing English politics. <laughs> you do know that there are open borders agreements in the European Union, right? Yeah, but you know, it's probably still a good idea to get a passport anyway. What the shit? Um. Oh. Okay. Uh, why are statues coming to kill us? Good question. Hmm. Right, so I'm assuming this is the way we go. This is the bit where we blow up the pyramid, which you thought was going to happen in the first encounter. It's actually this thing. Ah, oh, cool. And it will spawn two giant beasts. So, get your dick hard, because <laughs> it's about to get heavy. Ah, uh, yeah, he's a plunger. I'm getting it. I'm getting it. It's mine. It's mine. Alright, alright, alright. Oh. All right. <laughs> Secret oh, Mega shit. Ultra Explosion. Yeah, you thought I was kidding. <laughs> uh, a little bit. 
No. Now you should always trust me. Well, we killed him at the same time. Oh no, nice. we didn't. Oh, and their bodies just fell on top of each other. Oh wait, this is a secret. Oh no! Oh shit, that was my cannonball. <laughs> I thought this is where we were supposed I to go. I shouldn't be so, so distracted. Uh, we picked up, up a key or, or something, I think. Ah, oh, sweet. Oh, I've Did we not? I think that's a new record. Nice. I know. You're a full second behind. A centurion. A centen... Ah, uh, you know what I mean. What? No. <laughs> <sighs> I had a point at some point, but you know, I've lost it. Alright. So yeah, man, get your ass a passport. I do some trips. Yeah. It's not really the same when you're by yourself, though. <laughs> that sounded really, what? really uh, melodramatic. A lot more than I intended. What the hell? What's going? up with this fucking eye? See, no, oh. It's gone. All right, problems fucking solved. You gotta be kidding me. Gotta Nothing bad will happen. Oh wait, that door over there. I hope it's open. E. Oh wait, what the hell? Oh no. God, I hate this green fucking shit. Yeah, I hate green shit too. I mean, something's going wrong. Hey. Yeah. Oh shit. Shit! Say hello to my little friend. Banzai. Banzai. When I set fire to the rain. <laughs> Watch it burn as I. <laughs> I'm not sure why I'm suddenly thinking of that song, but I did. Well, you just had to sing it, didn't you? Yeah, that's Got the law. I with think your, with your dulcet tones, the deep baritone. When's your CD coming <laughs> out? Um. I've been talking point? about this uh, to my producer. <laughs> Is it a five CD collection? And um, yeah, we're just gonna go straight to the best off CD. Like <laughs> we're, not, we're not even gonna bother with like <laughs> yeah, we're not even gonna bother with like the regular CDs because you know the the big public doesn't really uh, like the major audience doesn't really buy that. No, like if you buy. Let's say you want to buy a CD from an artist that you've never even heard of. Wouldn't you want to start with the best of CDs? <laughs> exactly. Yes. So, if, you just so <laughs> if we just release a best of collection right away, everyone's going to buy it. Flawless thinking. It's true. Is it just yeah. going to be called like simply? Simply saying. Simply saying. Uh... Well, I'm not. We're not so sure about a title yet, but it's gonna contain the name, uh, the words "best" and "of." <laughs> of best. And everything beyond <laughs> that isn't really. Yeah, of and best. Of best. Of best. <laughs> yeah, but we haven't really uh, come up with much of a plan beyond S that. Simply Cedric. That's a really good. That's a really good. <laughs> <laughs> it would just have the, that and simply is written with a C. <laughs> Do you remember ages ago you posted a picture? I think your friend photoshopped your face onto a picture of like a naked guy with a bottle of wine. What? Don't you remember that you posted it on AMC? I think. Yeah, I don't know. If, I don't think it was you. My it. face on a bottle of wine. No, your face on a naked dude laying on a bed and he's got a bottle of wine covering his modest. <gasps> oh yeah, 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 yeah. That was. 
Yeah, yeah, I do remember that. Did you know that? Did you? I think. Uh, did you I think that? that was Jeffrey that did that. Oh, right, no, it then. was me. I did that. Oh, I you did, did that. It. that was yeah, funny. yeah, yeah. Did you know that I put that in the TC? It's above your bed in your room. Seriously? <laughs> <laughs> it's been in since episode one. I was, I was wondering if you ever noticed that. I thought, did he know I did that in there? Because <laughs> I thought, that's just oh, gee, I've never spotted that. It's got to oh, be. God, it's, I what? thought, I have to put that in there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I. That's actually like uh, the original. Is a picture of um, a fake... Well, uh, there's a comedian, an Australian, I think. And... Uh, he invented like a Swedish persona, a pop star, and he made some uh, songs that were in the mainstream audience, like "Ooh, you touch my tra la la," you know that song. <laughs> oh, That's yeah. uh, by that guy. Yeah. So the picture is, you know, that guy, <laughs> and then I put my face on it, and I was in, uh, I think, high school at the time. It's fucking funny. And I started uh, passing it around in, in to uh, some of my fellow uh, <laughs> high school students. <laughs> oh, that's I, yeah, I've, made I rounds. Just, I just photoshop my face onto the Terminator. And I got the piss taken out of me. Oh, sweet. <laughs> I wish I had still had those comments that Jeffrey made. I got the one he made of. Um, me in the imagination world at the end of episode one, but I don't have the ones he did of the old of AMC. <laughs> he also drew one of me like laying in a bed with a lady standing there, and I did like uh, ooh, an expression on my face in his comic style, not a proper style. That was my uh, yeah, those uh, comics were great. Uh, so old though. Yeah, they were. Yeah, I, 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 I scoured <laughs> all my backups, but I, I ain't got them anywhere, which uh, kind of pissed me off. It's a bit of history lost to the ages. Yeah. Oh well. <laughs> Shit happens. <laughs> it's all in memory now. We must pass it on Memories to our sons. It's like the corners of our hearts. Memories is a cinnamon synonym for boobies. Memories mean. Oh you might have said that. What oh the yeah, hell? memories. You went to yeah, memories. Walk yeah, but down I'm back now. It's all right. Lane. Oh, good, because I was worried for a second. Take that, monkey! Just rip off. <laughs> Secret health. Gee. Analyzing. Hmm. There's probably not much you can tell me about this situation, game. Try not to get crushed. Oh, right, and you're gonna that's throw your, toads at me. Thank that's you. your mission for now. Your mission, to, to choose to accept it, is not to die horribly. What one's the slowest one? Oh. Let them come. Oh, wait, no. <laughs> Let the body shit the frog. Let the body shit the frog. Let the body shit the do 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 that song is awful and amazing at the same time. Wait, Drowning Pool is the work of angels. <laughs> Ooh, you know, the guy's dead, so he's an angel now. Oh, so it's alright to listen to it now, we can pretend it's a high art. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can be like, yeah, I'm just mourning the dead. <laughs> The funniest thing I a video I it's saw is a healing that was, pr process. <laughs> it's healing part of the healing phase. The funniest thing I saw was someone dubbed that video over footage of loads of train crashes from Thomas the Tank Engine. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Jesus. Oh man. That that is. Jesus. Something else. I also remember someone that had added DMX videos over. Oh it. no, not not this. Oh, this is gonna be fun with my ping. What? Alright, let's just win. Easy.
Open sesame anytime soon. You must protect me with your laugh. <laughs> yeah, but they keep gunning for Thanks, me. Thanks, man. So. Oh, you're welcome. I'm your human shield, am I? Yeah, I'll, I'll be here a while. Uh, fuck you, yeah, I'm gonna stand on you. <laughs> hey, you actually take me with you. I didn't know that. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Loser. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna try that again. Oh, oh, no. Yeah, see? Yeah. Freedom. Let's go. Let's go. Not one, one man and left behind. Oh, Apart I have to leave me. you behind. <laughs> the door is not opening anymore. Come on, man. Get to the door. I'm trying. Come on, man. Come on, ping. Let me. Yeah, there we go. I got that to cover, man. Let's go. Let's go. Bridge and right. clear. Spec Ops the line. Spec Ops the line. Do you know, the, uh, the first few videos of Bro Team were funny, but then it kind of... Expected times. Oh, shit. Oh, some shit's still good. Oh, man. It, well, How are we ever gonna... Oh. My ping went bad for a second. You were running into a wall. Oh. I was like, oh god. <laughs> nice try. Yeah, no, it just got really laboured. Like, I think the first few were the decent right. ones. But I still got a couple of good ones. Oh, oh there we go. The fire is a teleporter. I'm not going to be just able to like do real this life in yeah. my condition. It's easy. You must become skill. The jumper. Feel the I jump. Was a, yes. I was a ninja. My kung fu was strong. Let's celebrate this with some fire. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey, it's like the last. This is going to get more. Oh no. It's like the, the last boss of Shadow Warrior in this room. The original, that is. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Shit! Yeah, that was a bit yeah, of a dickish right. thing to do in a fight, wouldn't it? It's like, oh, the fighting Zilla. Oh, oh, by the way, the floor tilts up and down. Actually, if by I the way, you don't right, even though, kill him either. <laughs> if I remember right, though, you d oh, I've just clipped through the floor. Oh, the game kind of saw that happen, I think. Oh, no. I don't think you slid yeah, down slopes seen. and slid down slopes in Shadow Warrior either. It was only in Blood that they actually coded in sliding down like slopes. In Duke Nukem, you know, you walk up a slope like it's not there, and the smaller the sector, the faster you move. Which was kind of retarded. Yeah. True, true, true. I kind of wish someone would just bite the bullet and code it in. It can't be that difficult. I would try and do it, but I'm just shit at maths. Like actual slopes that stop you, yeah. Yeah, it was just slope physics. I wanted to have that. Yeah, I might have to take a crack. I wanted here. to have that in Battlefield 3, so I just made them all conveyor belts. Like really steep slopes. <laughs> Problem is though, is that obviously the floor moves, so then it's like, why is the floor moving? <laughs> yeah, so I just made them pitch black. Problem fucking solved. <laughs> Uh, the things we did and build. The things we still do and build. Yeah. Why are we using this piece of shit software? <laughs> At least we appreciate it's nostalgic badly and we're not trying to shove millions of polygons and shader models into it. Cough. True. Now I don't begrudge <laughs> that. I don't begrudge that, but... Uh, no, there's only so much. All right, do. man. If I remember correctly, there's a secret in one of the windows. Like a tiny little thing. Not one of those ones. What yeah, this guy. Check this out. Where are you? Where'd you go? Come back here.
Come back here, man. Come back? I think you've gone ahead. Shit. No. Well, maybe. There here, you go. I'm here. here. Yeah. Here's a secret. Whoa. Shoot that shit. There, we win the game. WTF is all I can say. Yeah. Blondie. Probably a Duke reference or some shit. I just think of the singer. Oh! Yeah, the flamethrower is quite useful in this game. I like that it actually sticks. Yeah, it's good. They really knew their shit, these guys. Flamethrowers in games are either completely fucking useless or amazing. I remember the one in Return to Castle Wolfenstein looked, a bit, looked, looked amazing. It wasn't that useful. Because enemies would still shoot at you whilst on fire. And the Kingpin one was just hilarious. The Kingpin had a flamethrower? Yeah. <laughs> oh, jeez. I haven't played that game in so long. Yeah, I don't think it's aged very well. I actually remember very little of it. Yeah, it looked it looks still looks quite good. It looks good got good art design, but the gameplay is coming out. There's actually a mod released for it a while ago called uh, Nightwork at the Factory, which I reviewed on my on my like site thingy that I kind of stopped oh, updating. Product about placement. A year ago. I stopped that dating it a year ago. I was like, oh, uh, yeah, I'll review this. But then, there's, to be honest, there's been fuck all out. No mods or anything to really review. But um, it was quite good. Like, really good. Confusing levels, hmm. but realistic. Okay. Like, imagine if Gambini made a kingpin mod. That's what it makes me think of. I actually, like, emailed the author because I thought, you know what, I'm going to email this guy. And then, like, we kind of emailed each other back and forth for like a year. But I've heard the author of Kingpin? No, 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 the author of this mod. Oh, yeah, okay. Sorry, sometimes I'm a little slow. Sometimes you're thick as pig shit, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you bitch. No, the original... No, wait, 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 wait. The original didn't have this. No, yeah, that's what I was saying. The original, you could walk along the walls. Which is what I was yeah. saying before when we first played this. Which is, this sucks. So that's why they give you this wall instead. That which is... Compensate for it. Yeah, it's kind of shit, really. If anybody doesn't uh, know what I don't, banging on I don't about, really like this as much yeah, as shit. in the original. For anybody who doesn't know what banging on about, in the original there was no rotating shit. You could just walk up along the walls and you would just walk up it. It was fucking cool. And they didn't use it very much at all, which they should have done. No, you can't you overuse features, man. No, that's what I mean. They didn't overuse it. Fuck they didn't you, use it you frogs. I thought it was a really cool feature. It's sort of like what Prey did. Mm -hmm. But before Prey, obviously. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These fucking... So, seen any good films or film trailers lately? Nope. I haven't been watching any movies, man. Too cool. I've been uh, watching Supernatural again, like the series. Uh, is that any good? Uh, my brother wants yeah, to man. It. Yeah, it's actually really damn good. Yeah, it's at 11 seasons now, though, which is a bit much. Uh, yeah, but fucking hell. Yeah, it's worth uh, worth seeing. Any good ideas we can? Steal I'm at season four now. Any good ideas we can steal for the AMC TC? 
<laughs> uh, maybe. I mean, probably. <laughs> lovingly homage. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, yes. We don't steal. Stealing is wrong, kids. Unless you give credit for it or acknowledge it, and then it's only slightly as bad. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I saw the Doctor Strange trailer, which is quite cool. It's kind of trippy. It made me realise though that, like, most of uh, the AMC has like a counterpart in the Marvel universe. Like, obviously, your Doctor Strange, <laughs> Merlane is four. Is that a? Uh, is that that's Marvel? Yeah. Yeah, Marvel. That's what I mean. Yeah, I heard about it, but I'm uh, not really hyped for it at nah. all. Benedict Cumberbatch. I've never even heard of, of Doctor Strange, to be a, honest. He's a bit of a maniac, really, but he's kind of charismatic as an actor. Just too bad about his political opinions, which are like. He, did you hear about Who? what, he, what uh, Benedict Cumberbatch, the guy who's playing Doctor Strange? Oh, Sherlock Holmes. Engelbert Humperdinck. Yeah. <laughs> he played Sasquatch, but Dunk Dunk. <laughs> Benedict coming as Natch. <laughs> yeah, he, he was doing a performance of like Hamlet and then he stopped in the middle of the scene to start talking to the audience about why we should let Syrians come into our country and things like that. It was really out of place. Oh god. Yeah, That's I know. pretentious. The thing is that if he'd done that, I would have said don't come back to my theatre because people don't pay money to see you preach it and they pay money to see a performance of Hamlet. Yeah. Just... Yeah, I watched Massive Attack. Uh couple months back and they pulled the same shit like they would display all kinds of uh, political messages while they were performing uh. but you know that's to be expected coming from them you know because they never really hide the fact that they are engaged in that way nah I suppose not I don't really, I didn't really care for it this is a problem though most famous people just I have terrible political opinions and they don't really know anything because they're rich. And I well, don't mean their opinions maybe aren't terrible per se, but I always wonder what kind of arguments they have. Like, all they do is throw around cliches and, you know, give yeah. one sentence opinions. Well, preferably say... shit that, that you can uh, explain press in 140 well, characters, you know. Yeah, I, should t I take back what I said. It's not because they're rich. It's because they're famous and they, they basically say what they think people want to hear to get more famous. Like, this is why I don't like many comedians mm. anymore because none of them have their own opinions. They just seem to say what they think will get them, like, the most youngest viewers and stuff like that. So, you know, it's like, why am I mm, Maybe, but there's still there are still some good comedians, but... Yeah, the mainstream British comedians, well, they aren't really that good. Like, Miranda? Can't fucking stand it. Yeah, I don't. She just kind of looks a bit like... Like it. the guys that fill up uh, the Hammersmith Odeon, or I guess the Apollo now. Yeah. She and they say some, you, you know, s some shit that's not really that funny, and they got the audience in stitches, and it's like, what? Yeah, I know. Miranda kind of has kind a face of like an Easter Island statue, I think. <laughs> what? <laughs> I let that sink in for a while. Oh, yes, a demon did execute me. Yeah. I was letting myself get distracted. You always do that. The snake was dead. The final rocket was an exclamation mark. <laughs> Man, jumping sounds are fun. Oh, nasty. Uh oh, I did something. Oh no. Let's take out the giant whirlwind. Shit, yeah, the awesome boss music. 
which I can't really hear, but oh well. Wait, did they take out the serious bombs, or are we just now getting them? They might have taken them out, because I ain't seen one either. I swear we got one at some point. Hmm, maybe it's just not present in co-op. Because, you know, what's the point? True. That might be it. Alright, bitch. Let's circle strafe the boss. Man, the boss fights in the second encounter made me cry when I was a kid. Why? <laughs> like this was this was our Dark Souls, man. Uh, I don't know. I thought they were easy. I don't think I struggled with them. What? Whoa, he's got even me. in the originals. Yeah. Well, you're a stronger man than I am, sir. Well, we know that. <laughs> Some things just go unsaid. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Dick butt. <laughs> Dick butt. <laughs> there we go. We won the game! Three. Oh, no, still died. We just gotta clear up the trash. Oh, everything died. Yeah. All right, cool. On to Babylon. You turn me Babylon. on. You big Babylon. The ziggurat. Oh yeah. <laughs> ziggurat is a temple tower that the ancient Assyrians, <laughs> as. <laughs> <laughs> oh, down to the shit shooter. Oh, I do love this. Yeah, thing. I fucking. I love Babylon, man. Holy shit. Like the, I mean, the maps in the second encounter. Yeah. This I, is truly the high point of, the of all encounter. games ever made. <laughs> Just look at that shit, man. Yeah, uh, to be honest, so after playing Whoa. Dark Souls and seeing like Anna Londo. Hey, dude, look up. Look up, dude. <laughs> There's a city in uh, I'm Dark glued Souls to you, man. Anna, Anna Holy Alondo, shit. And it looks amazing. You just see it, it's this big yeah. old huge mess of cathedral towers and shit. And like, oh, wow. Mm. Oh, and I fucked okay. up. Yeah. Where am I now? Oh, oh, oh so did I, though. So it's alright. We suffered. What together. the f fudge? Yeah, where the hell? Oh, they just bought. If took pity on us, basically. It's like, how did you fuck that up? No, I wanna, I wanna do it. All you wanna do is do it. Bigger, bigger. Fuck! I fucked up. I picked up the health and then died instantly. Well, of course. You did. Take that! You God damn, to, this is difficult. You should be able to eat the pumpkin. Shit! Oh, there's another secret. Ooh. I'm going to try to get to hey, it, Hey, I man. got it. Even if it takes forever. It forever. Oh, hey, here we go. Made it. Oh, it's just a short. Oh, well, I'm not going to complain. <laughs> and you remember this strife. Yes. I get the feeling I'd think it was shit if I read it again, but at the time it was amazing. It was like, oh, it's a comic made with Bill. I think it's still around, isn't it? Might or be. maybe not. Probably somewhere uploaded. I think the last I heard of it, it was hosted at strifestrips.com. I might have to Google it. But something but that shit was awesome back in the day. Uh, one of them was like, uh, confuse your roommates by using random dictionary terms that are out of place. And like Duke saying to the Doom guy, Good morning, Doom Marine, you're looking rather maladorious today. And Doom goes, like, What the fuck are you talking about? And the Duke just goes, No need to be so pummel, Marine. <laughs> so funny. Funny. <laughs> I might have to try that. I also like I like to use in cromulent and in bigoning. <laughs> cromulent. It's a 
perfectly Cromulent word. <laughs> the irony is, is that now you the, you could consider them actual words because they were made up, but aren't all words made up? So now they can be used. Hmm. <laughs> you probably get marked it's down true. on the English. All words say, are you made up. <laughs> well, I don't know. Language is supposed to be a free creation. Yeah, well they're saying that. I don't I don't want that actually, because then LOL and shit like that will be considered proper lingua franca. Hmm. True. So what about this shit? I think that's probably the last We've the gotta throw more switches. That's probably what we had to come here from. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah yeah yeah. Shit, I confused my own brain. Oh, there we go. It's just this way. It's easy. Oh, okay. I was overthinking it. No Thanks, man. Oh, wait, Save my nice. butt. <laughs> I just said no scope. I was looking I for uh, my sniper rifle there. Hey. I was rummaging through my pants like, where's that fucking rifle? Oh, no. <laughs> But then Beams John stepped in. <laughs> Beams. Uh. Hey, you couldn't walk back up this in the original. This is all a lie. It's all a lie. <laughs> so what's with the lines? The lines? The lion statues, oh, right, with oh. the wings and shit. The griffins, I guess. No, that's just Babylonian shit, isn't it? Did all Babylonians just have huge beards or something? Yeah. Oh. oh. It's funny because the Dwemer in uh, Morrowind uh, basically looked like Babylonians. Really? Hmm. Yeah. You see pictures of them and stuff, and they got the beards like exactly like them. And the, the story to Morrowind was quite cool actually. And then it went downhill with the Elfins. The Nerevarine. <laughs> Where did you get a double shotgun? I didn't. I haven't got one. Oh. <laughs> Jumping the okay. I, I'm just making shit up then. Sorry. <laughs> did you beat that game, by the way? Morrowind. Mm. Yeah. Morrowind, yeah, I did. Yeah, yeah, it's uh, one of the greatest games of all time. Uh, I mean, at the times it wouldn't crash. <laughs> yeah. yeah, this is true. Because that shit crashed a lot. a lot. Especially if you have mods going, which you can't blame them for the mod crash. Yeah, but like. Vanilla game, yeah. The current more um, Bethesda games like uh, Skyrim and Fallout are comparatively not Stay. buggy. <laughs> no, also they run better because I think Morrowind only needs graphics card for the war. Everything else was CPU based. Um, I don't know about that. Well, Could I, be. It might be because my computer at the time was kind of shit. But I still love that game. The gameplay itself, like pull it down the brass tacks is kind of shit, but it makes up for it in areas. <clears throat> I've yeah. already told you about this, but so, some people are, have recreated it. Oh, yeah, I, you did tell me that, yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll replay it once that's done. Because I'd like to play it through. Yeah. At some point. But Morrowind had some cool shit that's sort of missing now from the current yeah. Uh, open world games like well, this nowadays is... you can just click on your map to any marked location and fast travel there instantly and back in Morrowind you had to go search for silt striders and, or some oh, shit like striders that. striders were just amazing, you hear the sound. Yeah, and also you could um, levitate. Yeah, they took that. They took so much away. I understand why they kind of did it, but at the same time, the game and everything, yeah, but the leveling now, it's like, you know, Morrowind, there's like places you go and you find really powerful rings, but that's what made it cool. But 
because it's like, oh, I found this, yeah. and it spiced it up. But in Skyrim, you don't get any of that. It's all perfectly level and oblivion. It's all perfectly level. Yeah, and you you can make yourself like uh, insanely overpowered. Like you can enchant your pants to instantly heal you whenever you get hurt. You can make like a boost intelligence potion and make an a, a, a even better one because you're a bit smarter. And basically keep going until you feel like a god. But yeah, I like that because that's I think that's in the spirit of the Elder Scrolls story. Yeah. And but we won't. So you get have that to again. be smart. Yeah, we won't get that again though because um, obviously they you know, they make these games now for the wider audience. Yeah, only the stupid ones. Well, we say <laughs> fucking that, neck then, beards. <laughs> yeah, you look at the, you look at the stories of the newer ones, and you know that's probably not too far off. I, someone I got linked. I saw an article on Arkham's codex about someone basically deconstructing the big four to fall out four. And I agreed with them, a lot of them. It was a really long article. What was it about? Well, it was basically listing like 13 problems with Fallout 4. I think they deliberately just did it in the clickbait sort of way to get people to read it, which worked. But the list was well thought out. But it uh, picks holes in the right in everything, basically saying what's wrong with the game. I agree with a lot. I think the, the one I agree with the most was just that the, the game just doesn't seem to have a tone. You can't settle on one. Like it's, it's tried to be goofy Fallout and stuff, but then it also tries to have serious things like the character, like the family drama. And you know, you walk, you've yeah. got like one, you got you're fighting raiders in one area, and then it's fucking. Next, it's trying to be a haunted mansion, and then the next, it's like, oh, there's a boat stuck in a building that you got to get off, and it's like, it just feels like they picked out loads of cool ideas and just stuck them in there, even though some of them don't really fucking fit. Like we like the silver cloud. Hasn't it always been like that, though? I think Fallout always had some funny and scary moments. Yeah, but not so much like this. I think. I don't know. It just. I well, don't really mind that. Like, it makes for some neat uh, breaks in tone sometimes. Like, well, yeah, can be I, serious I don't mean the whole time. I don't mean the levity. Sorry, I mean more like the themes. Like, it just can't seem to decide whether it's um, you know, it doesn't hmm. have an identity anymore. That's probably the best way to put it. Like, what is Fallout now? It's like, oh, it's retro, fifties, futuristic, but now it's not anymore because. You know, a lot of stuff ain't like it, so what is it? Post apocalypse, with loads of goofy shit. Hmm. Yeah, maybe. Still yeah. haven't finished it, I just kind of stopped playing it when I got to the Institute. Yeah, I. I That's where I got bored with it. it. I was oh, like, yeah. every fucking quest is just go here and kill this. So, kill. fuck it. Murder, death, kill. Death, kill. Oh, oh, Shit. Oh. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> <laughs> His death fallen sounds like amazing. <laughs> <laughs> So gruesome though. Poor Max. <laughs> it sounds like Painted a Max. It sounds like he was he was trying to jerk off, but then suddenly a picture of his mum popped up on his computer. <laughs> Just in the moment he came. <laughs> 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 oh fuck's sake. <laughs> that would be my reaction. You nasty as well, man. <laughs> I can never play Max Payne ever again. <laughs> Did I actually, I, that's I'll... the night the pain started. <laughs> oh, that's not the last thing. Today I was like putting away some d freezer delivery, minus 30 degrees. And I just thought, you know, I wonder if someone's tried to make a porno based on the Bible. <laughs> based on the Bible, I'm sure someone has done it. Probably. I mean, that would take a whole new meaning to thy comfort me with my, thy rod and thy stuff, wouldn't it? 
<laughs> Jesus. <laughs> wow, this fire effect on this serious power is really goofy. The effect is quite cool though. Can you even see what Can I even see what what what? What you're doing. Yeah. Like, just put a fire effect around stuff. the borders of the screen, which is proper like you know yeah. it's almost as cheesy as that black shirt with the um <laughs> fire effect on the bottom. Do you know I feel guilty okay. my, Hey, do, do you, have you ever seen those shirts? You know those really cheesy awful ones that are like black but they got fire on the bottom of them. What? No. Well we got them and they're really goofy looking. Uh, they're not great. T-shirts that say fire. No, shirts, shirts. No, don't say fire. They're shirts, right? Like dress shirts. They're black, but down the bottom they've got like a decal of fire around the base of them. Oh, no, I've never seen anything like that. No. Like an actual shirt. Yeah. Hmm. Like a dress Why shirt. Why would you... Because like... Yeah, a shirt usually says, you know, I'm professional and an adult. So then you slap fire on it. Yeah, exactly. And this is just to thing. keep I felt looking cool. Because it was a gift from my brother. Oh, sorry. <laughs> no, no, no. This is the thing. It was a gift from no my brother. No offense, man. I did not, no, I didn't want to wear it at all. I never wore it. But I felt guilty because I was like, you know, oh, my brother got this for me and I, and I fobbed, him, fobbed it off. Oh. But, well, you know, oh well. Maybe your brother just uh, this was a long doesn't time know ago. you, man. This was a long time ago, though. But you still haven't forgotten. Still have the memory. <laughs> how, how are they doing, by the way? Oh, uh, good, yeah. You're, uh, he, I think he wants to Eli become... Eli must be, like, five, five years old or some shit or now. Yeah, he is, and... Uh, uh, yeah. We've got a daughter now, Annabelle, who's like one and a bit. Oh, cool. Yeah, they're doing all right. I haven't seen them for a while because uh, obviously we just haven't had a chance to catch up. But he wants cool. to become yeah, a, count nice. a, a counselor or something for Lee Park, and he wants me to help deliver him leaflets with him. I was like, I'll do that as long as I Your don't brother. have to actually. Yeah, no, I, I don't know, but no, I support him as far as I can do. Oh yeah. He's a conservative, sort of. Sort of like you, I guess, hmm. but... Well, I'm not really that conservative. Nah. Well, you said you're right-leaning, though. I watch gay porn. <laughs> I don't mind giving a reach around. <laughs> I'm open-minded. <laughs> you know, if uh, Henry... I don't remember his... Uh, if Henry Cavill... ...wife or whatever. His girlfriend. What? I said, if Henry Cavill, aka okay, Superman, yeah. flew down and said, James, will you come away with me? I'll be, I'd throw myself in his arms and go, take me now. I'd probably regret that the second he actually entered my, bum, my bottom. <laughs> I'd be like, I'm not gay, take it out. Please, I've made a horrible mistake. <laughs> I think there may have been a mistake. <laughs> I just want the lady plan. Wait a minute, there may have been a mix up. <laughs> I'm I thought we were off I'm to see Lois. <laughs> I'm not gay. I've changed my mind. I thought we were gonna beat up Ben Affleck. <laughs> uh, Shit. <laughs> Mother. <laughs> oh dear. Ma'am, Henry Cavill's done poking me up the bum. He's taking me up the chocolate speed bike. <laughs> What? <laughs> Shit, I've never heard that expression. Oh, that's brilliant. Oh, that's amazing. Oh. Chocolate speed train. <laughs> that is awesome. I gotta remember that. Oh, dear. <laughs> no, but yeah, his girlfriend was nice. I don't really remember much of that. 
Uh, Kelly, yeah. Well, she was like, have a safe journey home! And all that shit. <laughs> well, to be honest, it's not like she could say, I don't actually care if you live or die, mate. <laughs> 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 That's also true. <laughs> I'd say that to my mortal enemy. Yeah, have a safe trip, mate. Try not to trip down the stairs. <laughs> I'm gonna travel to the distant temple and see what happens. <laughs> what this? Oh, oh, that one. The Taj Mahal. Is it? No, that's India. No. What I said before. Yeah, oh, you yeah. fucking racist. Racist bastard. <laughs> And you're it's calling me a conservative. Look alike, is it? <laughs> True. <laughs> Fucking copycats. It's because they're lazy shit. Yeah, they're not good on the They're so lazy, like they us can't us even design like, their own shit. Like us Europeans. Man, you are quite a while away. This is quite poetic, actually. For walking shit. through a field of flowers. Oh, you died. You can't go that far. <laughs> what a letdown. I watched my mom again. There's another ball that's just got stuck somewhere. Oh, here we yeah, go. I'm sure oh, we have some more before. buttons to press. I like the first button. I like to push it, push it. I like to push it. Hmm. Ah. Take it. Ah. 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 Blue car behind you! Oh, that thing. No. I got two barrels. The door is still it. not open. <laughs> Where are we going? Probably that building over there that we've completely. Made. Where do we go from? Uh oh. They're coming to blow us up, man. They're coming to blow us away. <laughs> They're coming to blow us away. <laughs> oh, to the graveyard where life is very peaceful and great mystery and blah blah blah. Okay. What drugs are you on and can I have some? Uh, I'm pretty much gone crack cocaine. Smoked and cooked. And that's not one of tripping balls on mushrooms. Oh. Well, <laughs> I'm like, my yes, mom always said, laughs like, <laughs> no. Because <laughs> for a second I was like, wait a minute, he doesn't actually believe me, does he? Me doing drugs. <laughs> Why would I ever believe you on anything? <laughs> yeah, this is true. Probably the best advice in general. My mom always said, laughs like a good high. You never know what you're gonna get. <laughs> drugs are bad, okay? Don't do drugs, drugs are bad. How would you like to see the school counselor? How would you like to suck my balls, Mr. Garrity? <laughs> oh, press the left wing. Oh, fuck me, there's a lot of them. Saturator. You know, I cheated on a test once. Oh, what test? I didn't know the answer to a question and I wrote down up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, BA. <laughs> they still fucking flunked me. <laughs> oh, that's cheesy, man. Oh, you play Yeah, well. Wing. What? No, I was just saying, you placed your wing. I'm going to die. But not today, motherfuckers! Who wants to okay, live probably today. Forever? Who dares to judge forever? I will never try to sing Freddie Mercury again. Never do this. 
please. <laughs> he's literally just jolted awake in his coffin, his skeleton. He's like, Mars. He's coming to get you, boy. <laughs> You know what's funny? Like, one day we'll be like in the far future, and then the second coming of Christ will be a historical event. Yeah. Like, yeah, a thousand years ago there was the second coming of Christ. Oh, wait, I think Futurama may have invented that as a throwaway joke. Probably. Yes, millions died many years ago during the second coming of Christ. Is that just another cheap gag at religion joke or did they have a point with it? I think it was just a stupid little joke. Uh, oh, there's me. Have you seen Futurama? Yeah. Good, good. I was already sharpening the axe. It would be pretty hard for me not to have seen Futurama. Yeah, it would have taken away all of your nerd cred. I didn't think it was as good as The Simpsons. Obviously not the nerd Simpsons, because those are just what? awful. It's m a lot better than The Simpsons. Oh, I disagree wholeheartedly. I would like, say. Seasons okay. 2 to like 6 of The Simpsons are just absolute gold. Like, even now hmm. I, I watch an episode and I still find something to laugh at. And, like the old ones, not the new ones. Like, The Simpsons has been bad longer than it's been good. That's really depressing. Yeah, that is that is true. Someone needs to just kind of put it out. How many game. seasons does it have? Like, 20 fucking... 6, eight? 27. Oh. <laughs> oh, in Miko's Brave New World mod, he had a poster up saying, Simpsons, season 26, out now, as a joke. And I posted it on the end, and said, Did you know that Simpsons would still be running at this point in time? And it actually exceed that number. <laughs> the Simpsons is gonna be around forever. Well, that's the thing. One of the voice actors actually left. I think Henry Casanova. I think it's him. The one who does like half of the, or, of the fucking show. Her Harry Shearer, I think. Yeah, yeah. Not the one who does. Well, I'm not the sure. Other guy. Yeah, it's like, yeah the, that. That's Dan Cast. No, Hank Azaria. Yeah, I think one of them anyway. Or is it? Like, or is it Dan Castellaneta? Yeah, yeah. I Homer is Dan. Him. Yeah. Wait, maybe I'm confusing a few people. One of them left. That's all the point we got. Over yes. <laughs> Sorry. And it's, it's like, you know, they're just replacing them, and it's like, well, surely take the hint. Yeah, it's time to wrap it up. Although, you know, Futurama just wasn't that good anymore either after, like, the rebirth stuff. Like, the magic was gone. Yeah, because it end originally it ended like, you know, the last episode was originally like, this Fry swaps his hands with the devil, and then Lee Lee gets yeah. and, and that was a good place to end on. Yeah, exactly. The only thing I thought was stupid was the romance between Lee Lee and Fry, because it made no sense. Yeah, it was written by a lonely person, probably. Yeah. <laughs> That's exactly it, because he's just like a stereotypical nice guy, and it's like, you know... Oh, she ends she's up the, hat, the hot action chick. Yeah, she eventually falls in love with him after she's dated like 20 other people, and it's like, you know... Yeah. Does this not make Fry look even more pathetic? Yeah. Instead of it being a really sweet romance, it's like... Yeah, you wore her down enough that she decided to give you a chance. There's nothing about that that's good, man. I'm hearing a secret. You're hearing a secret? Yeah, I'm hearing a creaking door. Uh, oh, it's only 5 past 11. I thought it was later than that. There's a secret here. Oh, there we go. Where is it? There, that was it. <laughs> secret? What the fuck? Yeah, he punched a demon, or you know, uh, an an alien. 
one of them reptile wizards. Fight fire with fire. <laughs> Man, that reminds me, I really need to completely overhaul the chainsaw on the AMC TC because it's shit. <laughs> It'd be hard work, but it'll be worth it, you know. It just needs to be a lumberjack from the room. It splatters blood all over the screen. It's up cut into black smoke from the petrol. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, 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 yeah, and then you could use the Tesla ammo pickup to like give it an electric charge. Yeah, oh, I'm getting a slightly nice idea. Oh, jeez. That would be pretty yeah. fucking sweet. I'm getting that... moist. <laughs> You're gonna flick your bean. <laughs> <laughs> schlick, schlick. <laughs> I still remember the time where I didn't know what an erection was. Like, I didn't know the meaning of the word <laughs> erection. Like, literally. Oh and I would God. say it in class and teachers would be like, yeah. <laughs> Go to the, I don't know, the principal's office, whatever. <laughs> oh my God. That's even worse than my story. When I was like, I, I was a of, bad boy. <laughs> I thought mine was bad. You did that at school. When I was like eight or something, my brother told me, um, he said, James, are you hungry? And I was like, yeah. And he said, well, if you go to mum and shout out really loud, I'm horny. That means that you're hungry. So I was like, okay. So I walked into the lounge. And mum and her partner at the time was sat watching TV and I just shouted, mum, I'm, I'm horny. <laughs> <laughs> and they were like, what the fuck? And my brother just pissed himself laughing in the bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Christ. Uh, that's probably the coming. first memory I have of, like, school was in kindergarten. Yeah. Uh, it was a very bad day indeed, for I had relieved myself twice <laughs> in class. <laughs> like, first, first I pissed my pants, <laughs> and, uh, you know, then, then the kindergarten lady gave me new pants and sat me down in a different classroom. <laughs> totally so then can. I just sat, then I sat, no, then I sat at a desk or I don't, I don't really remember all that well and uh, I felt my body going upwards oh god like, no I, 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 was, I gained a few inches of I don't know turns out I had shat myself as well <laughs> then they, they <laughs> at that point they were like are you fucking serious <laughs> then I called my mom <laughs> Oh, hey, I got to stay home from school that day, so that was a fucking win. <laughs> you just thought you'd love the levitating trick. Uh, I can fly, I can fly. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 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 that reminds me of a similar story. I, I was driver, I was in, I was driving with my brother, and he was like obviously driving a car, and um, suddenly I, I, I had a feeling like oh, oh, the seat I was got, I was on was really warm, and I was like, what, what, why, is, why is my ass really hot all of a sudden? I like shit myself or something? And I just started nervously shuffling and Kurt turned to me and said, have you, have you, did you just think you shit yourself? And I was like, yeah. And he said, I just, yeah, I just turned the heating on and just underneath your seat. And I was like, you bastard. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good tactic to try. Oh, just like secretly, surreptitiously, you know, turn on the heating underneath the passenger's seat and see if they start shifting uncomfortably <laughs> and going red. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
it's a good way to stay home from school, you know, shitting yourself. <laughs> <laughs> try it at work. I can't be asked yeah, to say, boss, boss, I've just <laughs> shit myself. <laughs> Get oh, yeah, I, I did try it. I did try it. And like, this behavior is not acceptable in the workspace. Oh, I need to come home It's not yourself. a good tactic. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, you've tried it, I see. Sounds like you're getting fucking murdered. <laughs> Fucking murdered. <laughs> hey, what's up? I came here just in time. <laughs> to save me from the queer skeletons. Let me help you out, man. <laughs> they want to roger me back. <sighs> God damn it. Gotta take a sip of water. Oh, the serious damage also increases the splash damage. Yeah, oh, probably not too surprised there. Stop nope. fucking killing me! You napped my shit. He's a shit napper. <laughs> there. You want it? Fucking take it. The butt pirate. Nice. <laughs> Truly. Some booty. With my brain and your brawn, we will make an excellent team. <laughs> oh shit! Why are you leaving me here? Shit's happening. Yes. Oh right, let's I go. refuse to go another step! I'm going to stay here, wait for my colleagues. Uh, A.K. Okay, what they said when the path had fucked up and they didn't know where to go. Oh, so many Half-Life yeah. mods where the characters would just stop following you around a corner and you had to just fucking nudge them. Oh, driving me fucking bananas. <sighs> yeah, especially in opposing force. Yeah. yeah. All right, you scout ahead. <laughs> sure, we could do more time. You're gonna have to way. go on without me, Gordon. <laughs> I'm afraid you're going to have to leave me here, Gordon. Oh, uh, half life. We need to play through that co op as well, actually. We can just do that Sven co op. Oh, mm. Techno Funk. I've played Half Life too much, wouldn't be very interesting. No, but it, we could get see how fast we can get through it in co op. It'll be fun. Just to... <laughs> like 20 minutes? Yeah. Just oh, yeah, have it. you ever seen, like, uh, the speed run of um, Morrowind? Not something like seven minutes, isn't it? Yeah, somebody they, just went ahead and killed Dagoff Ur in like seven fucking minutes. Yeah, they—they, they, I think they took the pinch the scrolls of Icarian flight, didn't they? And jumped across like uh, half could the island. Be. Oh, those those things were amazing. I actually used them once or twice, and I managed to live for it because I think I managed to land somewhere pretty safe. See, that's what's missing. The, the developers actually allow you to do things to break the game. Yeah. Nowadays, everything's so directed. Yeah. Carefully moderated, so you can't do anything they don't want you to do. And that's why most games are shit. Yeah. And everything's quality controlled. Well, mostly. And polished. <laughs> Fuck me. Mom. <laughs> <laughs> Um. I can't stop. <laughs> uh, God, what have I done? <laughs> All right, I think that's pretty, a pretty good stopping point for now, because I'm getting a little bit tired. <laughs>